Converting Python Script to Debian Package Setup In the previous video, we successfully created our Python script, designed it and executed it. In this video, we will focus on creating the package files and configuring some of the metadata for our Python script. We will now add files that are used to prepare the project for distribution in the maxc package folder, creating the package files. Setup.py is the build script for setup tools. It tells setup tools about our package, such as the name and version, as well as which code files to include. Let's write setup.py file. Name is the distribution name of your package. This can be any name as long as it only contains letters, numbers, underscore, and version is the package version. Description is a short, one-sentence summary of the package. Long description is a detailed description of the package. Long description content type tells the index what type of markup is used for the long description. In this case, it's markup. Author and author email are used to identify the author of the package. License is important to include it tells users who install our package the terms under which they can use our package. Packages is a list of all Python import packages that should be included in the distribution package. Package Dyer is a dictionary with package names for keys and directories for values. Classifiers gives the index and pip some additional metadata about our package. In this case, the package is only compatible with Python 3, is licensed under the MIT license. Environment is console. Operating system is Linux. An entry point is typically a function or other callable function-like object that a developer or user of your Python package might want to use, though a non-callable object can be supplied as an entry point as well, as correctly pointed out in the comments. The console scripts directive is important, and it'll create an executable script called map, which will be available system-wide after you install the resultant DEB. The data files directive will install a suitable desktop file into slash us or slash share slash applications so that you can also start Mac from your desktop environment. Mac.desktop looks like this. Keywords describing our script. Python requires gives the versions of Python supported by your project. Long description will be loaded from readme.md, which is a common pattern. creating MacC desktop file, so that you can also start Mac from your desktop environment. It describes the rights that we as a developer have and the other people have that will use our code. Selecting open source license from chooseolicense.com. readme.md for quick start guide and short description. Manifest.in, which describes file that should be encoded in our distribution, which are not included by default, which is used in bundling readme.md and license with our package. In the next video, we will learn how to create a Debian package and install it. Thank you.